it is almost impossible to believe that this guy, that this old man, this Walmart greeter, this uh, fake installed president, one, why the fuck is his wife with him wherever he goes? We didn't hire this person. I didn't hire you, Joe. You're a traitor. I know what you are. I know what Kamala is. I know what the Democratic Party is. And I know that we have a constitutional crisis of epic proportion. But hearing you talk about your house that, you know, had a little fire, you almost lost your cat in your Corvette. There are children that were incinerated to ash. You fucking old man. You vile human being. The only way you feel you're able to communicate and, and you have some kind of, you know, you're so out of touch with the common man, you don't even understand how to speak to them. The only way you think you can establish commonality with them is to lie. That the same thing happened to you, no matter what the tragedy is. Your son wasn't killed in action, by the way. Your house didn't burn down. Your children weren't burned to death. How dare you get up there and speak this way? Your job is to go there and assuage them in a way that you talk to them about their loss, that you can't imagine what it's like, that you can't imagine what it's like never to find the bodies of the poor children that were sent home from schools that died alone, alone, in fear, without their parents or a guardian, that the most abhorrent thing happened. You're a disgusting, despicable bastard. You're too old. You need to step down from office. Maybe the cackling hyena behind you. Maybe she'll rise to the occasion. She can't even form a coherent sentence. This is an outrage. An outrage. It should be, we should just rebuild the goddamn thing the way it was. When you hear the psychopath, the first thing out of the governor's mouth was, oh, we, we're going to reclaim the land for this or for that. Who the fuck are the people we hire in government? And if there's any truth to the matter that this idiot held back the water, he should be sent down to Guantanamo Bay, never to be seen again. It's just, just outrageous how we behave in this country. There's no adults. An, an event, no matter how tragic, there should be men that are able to rise to the occasion. In five seconds, you should know what to do. You should understand the right thing. You almost lost your cat. Go fuck yourself.